Hello friends, Dan from On One here. You've probably heard about all the great improvements we've made in On One Resize 2023.5, the new noise reduction and face recovery features, but did you know those are also integrated into On One Photo Raw 2023.5? Let me show you them in action. So here we are. I've opened up a photo from Browse into Resize. And what the first thing I want to show you are the improved noise reduction and face recovery tools in here. Let's take this photo. I'm going to zoom in on this dad and son. And you can see this is 100% on the original photo, not that big. We want to make it larger. I'm going to blow this up 4x. And now let's take a look once we zoom in here. I'll pan over so you can see it better. There we go. Now, you'll notice this photo has quite a bit of noise. And the problem is when noise gets resized, it gets bigger and yucky in the process. So we need to add noise reduction to fix this. Now, in the past, you could have added noise reduction to your photo inside of Photo Raw before you got to resize. And that's still a great way to do it. But now if you didn't get a chance to do that, or it, you don't really notice it at the small size, you don't notice it until it's enlarged, now you have it built in to resize when you might need it. So watch, I'm just gonna turn on noise reduction. This will scrub through the original photo before it's resized and will apply noise reduction to it. And I can adjust the amount slider to the amount of noise reduction that I need. I'm going to adjust it until I just get rid of the amount of noise that I want, about 70% for this photo. That works pretty good on the noise, but it also lost a little bit of detail. Well, we can bring that detail back with face recovery. When I turn this on, it's going to analyze the photo. It's going to find all the faces and it's going to actually rebuild new faces based on the structure of the faces underneath. So there we are. That's with face recovery on. Let me turn it on and off before and after. Isn't that amazing? It can actually find faces and make them look better. I'll show you the overall before and after. So there's the original information, noisy, yucky, scaled 4X, noise removed, faces recovered. Pretty cool, huh? Let me show you a couple more. I'll just pop up the film strip here in Photo Raw and pick a different photo for us to look at. How about this one? Let's say we love this, we want to use it for our profile pick, but obviously we want to crop everybody out of it. So I'll grab the crop tool, I'll adjust it down until it's just me, imagine I'm her, having a lot of fun, I'll crop it the way I want to, but shucks, it's way too small now to actually use for a profile pick because we're taking a very small portion of that photo. Well, let's blow it up in size till it's a better fit for what we need. I'm gonna go up, uh, we'll do 400 again, and that'll scale it, but there's not a whole lot of information to start with. It's not a very high res photo. It's a Polaroid, not very good. Turn on face recovery, and wow, look, now there's a nice natural face there again, something I can use for my profile pic and look good. This works the same on old iPhone images or old camera phone images where they're pretty small, you have a group shot, you want to take one person out of it, there you go. That noise reduction is super handy for photos that have a lot of JPEG artifacts. If you have an old photo that has a lot of compression to it or one that you may have gotten from a client or from a family member that's been over compressed and over sharpened, at screen size it looks great, like this photo looks great. Even if I zoom to 100, it looks pretty good. But as soon as I start to zoom in a little bit more, I'm going to zoom in here to this is 300% on the original file, all of a sudden you start to see those JPEG artifacts popping out. And that gets even worse if we scale it up in size. So let's do that same thing. I'm gonna blow this up in size here. Now you can really see all those nasty looking JPEG artifacts. You can see they're almost their little square blocks as it's compressing each little eight pixel block down to make it smaller. Doesn't look very good. We'll turn on noise reduction and we'll turn on face recovery. This will wipe away those JPEG artifacts, but bring back a nice realistic face for us, just like that. One more example that I think is really fun. You can actually use resize to take faces that are a little bit out of focus and make them sharp again. So we got this photo where almost all the faces are just a tiny little bit out of focus. I'm gonna blow this up 200% so we can see this even better. And you'll notice those faces are just a little bit soft. Now watch, all I have to do is turn face recovery on It'll find those faces and makes them sharp again. Look at that, before and after. So we went from those faces being out of focus to being in focus, for, after, just like that. There you have it. All the great new features in Resize 2023.5 integrated inside of Photo Raw 2023.5. Thanks for watching.